Scientists have just announced that something big is happening to the biggest star in the Milky Way galaxy. This has sent astronomers into a rush to try and observe and model this amazing star to understand the processes it is going through. What's happening? Just this year, astronomers were struck when they looked towards the largest star in our galaxy, VY Canis Majoris, and saw that it was reaching the end of its life. Thanks to the Atacama Large Millimeter Array Telescope located in the mountains of Chile, they were able to identify matter being ejected from this colossal star as it enters the final phase of its life. This star is classified as a massive red hypergiant, an extremely rare type of gigantic star which made this discovery all that more exciting being able to study one of these giants while it's in its death throe. Not only does this star have an immense size, it also has powerful ejections of mass analogous to the arcs that we see forming on our own sun, creating a fantastic stellar structure. Because of its gigantic size, this star is a fantastic observational subject, allowing astronomers to see it in fantastic detail and complexity. While it is much larger than our Sun, it is far younger. It is less than 10 million years old compared to the Sun's 4.5 billion years. And while the Sun is in the middle of its lifespan, VY Canis Majoris is already considered to be in its old age. But this star reaching the end of its life is an exciting event for astronomers. It will be the first time they will be able to observe the final phase of this type of giant star. What might researchers learn by studying this unique event? VY Canis Majoris is a massive red hypergiant that sits just over 3,000 light years away from us in the constellation of Canis Major. Red giants are a class of star that has reached the final stage of stellar evolution, a stage that our Sun will reach in approximately 5 billion years into the future. But this star, is no normal red giant, measuring in at between 15 and 25 times the mass of our Sun and over 1400 times its radius, making it a contender for the largest star in our galaxy. If this star was to replace our Sun in the solar system, its surface would nearly reach Jupiter. And unlike normal red giants with less mass that puff up during the red giant phase, Red hypergiants behave differently by going through sporadic mass loss events that create this bizarre, complex and intricate structure. The new structure is composed of knots, clumps and arcs of incredibly hot stellar material. Extremely powerful solar winds produced within the star help spread this emitted mass far out into space at tremendous speeds. Their makeup has intrigued scientists for quite a while and it is thought to aid in giving them their unusual design and may be responsible for their sporadic events of mass loss. These types of stars are exceedingly rare with only a few being known in our own galaxy. You may have heard of a few of them including Betelgeuse within the Orion constellation and the major star of the Cygnus constellation. Because of how rare these stars are, Scientists do not know much about these stars, including how they form and how they die. But luckily, this team of astronomers led out of the University of Arizona are working to change that. So far, they have been able to trace the emissions coming from the star and has allowed them to map the star's envelope, the star's range of influence. This marks the first time astronomers will be able to watch and record the death of one of these giants and will allow them to probe deep into the workings of hypergiant stars. They have been interested in what these stars do at the end of their lives. Many thought that hypergiants would follow what we consider a normal series of events at the end of its life, ending in a supernova event. But a new leading theory to these giants is that their unique makeup and structure will alter the events of their death and cause them to forego a supernova. For one, there has been no evidence found that one of these hypergiants has gone supernova in the past. If they did end in a supernova, we would expect to find some evidence of their massive fiery deaths. 
But because there is no evidence of ancient hypergiant supernova, many scientists familiar with these monsters have begun to adopt a new theory. This theory states that these stars will lose massive amounts of their material through emission, while the remaining mass collapses into a black hole. If they do skip a supernova and go straight to collapsing quietly into black holes like this new theory states, why and how does this happen? Hopefully, the information gathered by this team will be able to answer this question. Armed with a massive amount of data on this star, over a terabyte, they set out to generate a three-dimensional model of VY Canis Majoris in order to study it up close and try to understand its mysteries. One goal they hope to accomplish with this model is to try and understand the processes these stars go through as they reach their final moments. Once completed, the model will allow them to observe and study the intricate structure as well as the lead-up to its inevitable death. Giving them a view of this stellar giant from all sides will allow them to get a closer look at this star by simulating the processes that this star will undergo. Right now, the evidence points towards these massive stars quietly turning themselves into black holes when they finish burning their fuel. But the process by which this happens is still entirely unknown by astronomers. Hopefully, being able to observe the star as it currently is alongside their model will allow the team to watch this event unfold and understand what they see. Will they be able to answer the many questions surrounding these rare hypergiants? Regardless, someday, far into the future, scientists will be able to use their telescopes to watch VY Canis Majoris take its final breath as it dies and finally goes dark. To this day, nobody has been able to image this star complete or any star of this size. The current goal is to understand the mechanism used to shed their mass and exactly how their complex structure forms. Scientists are excited to see how VY Canis Majoris changes over the years ahead and see how much dimmer the star becomes as it continues to lose mass at a staggering rate. Thanks for watching. Leave us a comment down below and tell us about an amazing cosmic event or object that fascinates you. See you next time on Matter.